The chief of Homeland Security testified today about migrant family separations and conditions in detention centers. Alexandra Limon reports the acting secretary says Congress is to blame for those problems. The IG said it was blatantly false. Emotions ran high in the House Oversight and Reform Committee Thursday as the acting secretary of Homeland Security, Kevin McAleenan, said his department is doing all it can to manage the problem of children detained at the border. We're doing our level best in a very... What does that mean? What does that mean when a child is sitting in their own feces? This is familiar to you, seeing families, mothers and children, caged with mylar blankets. California Congresswoman Jackie Speer visited the border last week. Lawmakers scheduled this hearing to follow the release of a new report on child separation. When McAleenan couldn't answer questions about the report, Speer expressed her frustration. I explained okay, as well. Here's is the it... problem. You've had this report since last Friday. You should have come prepared. McAleenan agreed that facilities along the border are not appropriate for housing migrant children, but he says Congress hasn't done enough to fix the problem since he first told lawmakers about it a year ago. I and CBP leaders have warned of the border security and humanitarian challenges in more than 100 briefings and meetings on the Hill. McAleenan said perceptions of a loophole in U.S. laws lead to child trafficking. We've had egregious cases, including a 51-year-old man who bought a six-month-old child for $80 in Guatemala. McAleenan said ultimately Congress is responsible for the problems that stem from broken immigration and asylum laws. In Washington, Alexandra Limon.